there are a number of basic fighter maneuvers, or BFMs, which can be very useful in pursuing the enemy and in evading pursuing planes and missiles. Click on a maneuver to see it demonstrated. The brake turn is merely an abrupt change of course made in response to an attack. It is made with wings inclined 90 degrees. In other words, the plane is tilted on its side and the stick is pulled back, quickly changing your heading. A side effect is that you tend to quickly lose speed. This maneuver exposes you to strong G-forces and will cause you to black out if sustained too long. The scissors maneuver is really a series of turns and counter turns where you and the enemy are attempting to drop in behind one another. You must attempt to get the enemy plane to fly past you by turning and dropping speed little by little by toggling the B key to turn your speed brake on and off. The battle alternates back and forth until one plane takes the lead or drops out. If such a battle lasts for an extended period of time, the repeated turn and brake maneuvers could easily lead to a stall situation. The early turn is a tricky maneuver, which requires precise timing. It is used to get behind your opponent from a head-to-head -head position. To perform this maneuver, you need to anticipate your opponent's future position in relation to your own. The trick is to turn early enough so that the enemy plane passes you and cannot begin turning until your turn is nearly complete. This places you on the enemy's tail in a superior fighting position. The Immelmann turn is the exact inverse of the split S. It reverses your direction of flight by combining a climbing half loop and a half roll. Start this maneuver from level flight or a slight dive. Pull back on the stick and continue your loop until you are flying inverted, facing in the opposite direction. Since you lose a great deal of airspeed, it is wise to add thrust by pressing the A key to engage the afterburners. Once the loop is complete, a simple half roll completes the maneuver. The split S is a maneuver to reverse your direction of flight, which combines a half roll and a dive. It is an offensive maneuver designed to increase airspeed for a quick attack. This maneuver causes you to lose a great deal of altitude, so make sure that you have at least 5,000 feet to play with. Begin the maneuver by doing a half roll so that the plane is upside down. Then pull back on the stick. As you begin to dive, press the minus key to reduce your airspeed so that you don't lose too much altitude. When you are level again, you will have turned 180 degrees with your speed drastically increased. The loop is a combination of a split S and an Immelmann. It is designed to avoid a pursuing enemy and put you in his 6 o'clock position at the same time. Make sure you have plenty of power when you start, because you will lose a great deal of airspeed in the first half of this maneuver. Pull back on the stick as you did in the Immelmann turn. This time, when you reach the top of the loop, continue to pull back on the stick initiating a dive. When completed, you'll be facing the same direction as when you started, and hopefully you'll be on the pursuer's tail. Although this tactic may be useful against enemy planes, a pursuing missile with its tighter turning radius is seldom shaken with this maneuver.